solve 8x raised to the power minus 2 equals to 2 all over 25. It's a jam question. Now, what we are going to do first of all, we can find out that our this x is having the power of negative. So what we're going to do is to let's solve. We have 8, then there's a times here, right? Times this x here, eh? there is all over 1 there, which is the what? The base. So what we're going to do is to look for the base. The base of this x, which is all over 1, and the reciprocal of it, which means it's going to come up. So that we now have times 8 times 1 all over x, then this square will no longer be negative. So that we now have it equals to 2 all over 25. So that we have 8 times 1, we give us 8 all over then x square equals to 2 all over 25. Here we can collect like you can cross multiply rather. So that we have x squared times 2 equals to 8 times 25. We can divide both sides by 2. So that we have x 2 cancel 2. Then 2 here 1. 2 in 8 is 4. We can I have x squared equals to 4 times 25. Now, what I'm going to do next is, is that... We can find out that this is our baby stop equals to 4 times what? 25. We can find out that this 4 here have a perfect square and this 25 have a perfect square. So that we now have s square equals to this of reason 4. You can actually use 2 plus power 2 times. Yeah, we can actually use 5 plus power 2. We now have x square equals to 2 times 5. Then all in square. Yes, it's a lot of indices. Now we can find that the, the, the power are the same. Then we can equally equate the base. So the power is the same. We can equal the base. So we now have x equals to 2 times 5. So that our x is now equals to 10. This is our final answer. And don't forget to subscribe to my, my channel for more video tips. Thanks.